to another Fit Friday video. Welcome back, y'all, to another video. Y'all can see I got on my Creed attire right now. I feel like I'm about to go to somebody's boxing gym. Y'all, I'm about to go run a mile, okay? So, back to work. Yesterday, I took Harlow on a walk and we basically walked around this trail that we have in our area. Before we started walking, I put my Apple Watch on outdoor walk. Y'all, four times around that thing was a mile, like little over a mile. So I'm like, you know what? This would be the perfect form of cardio for me to do for my fasted cardio. So one, I mean, I've really been wanting to start running miles and just really, you know, work on my endurance and also get my mile under 10 minutes, but it'll be perfect. Like the trail is literally like right there. It's nothing for me to just walk outside and go ahead and run this trail a few times throughout the week just to really make sure I'm getting my heart pumping. You know, obviously when you're running, you like, for me, I don't like running, but I always feel super good afterwards. So this is about to be my new form of facet cardio that I'll just do sometimes throughout the week, um, just to get a really good cardio session in before my actual workout. So I was just about to say I need to eat something. <laughs> I don't because this is fast, which means you run, you do your workout on an empty stomach. I'm not gonna take pre-workout. I'm not gonna do anything like that. This is literally on an empty stomach. I'm just gonna drink some water and then we'll be, we'll be back. I won't take y'all out there with me just because you know, safety, you know what I'm saying? So I will see y'all when I get back. I'm trying to find my built bar, y'all. Shout out to Built Bar for being a sponsor for this portion of today's video. Y'all know I've been talking about Built Bar. These bars are so good. Protein bars, but they're candy bars. They taste like candy bars. They're so yummy. They have high protein. Y'all, they are low calorie. They're not made with all that extra stuff. This is the cookies and cream flavor. I have ripped through the packaging, but if y'all don't know, I love cookies and cream. Love it. That's my favorite flavor of ice cream. Love it. So when I saw that I had a cookies and cream flavored Built Bar, definitely had to try it. This is my first time trying this Built Bar, so we're gonna try it together in three, two, one. Y'all, when I tell y'all, I just can't get over how these literally taste like a candy bar. How is this a protein bar? <laughs> Somebody tell me. I know in last week's vlog, I told y'all that mint chocolate has been like my go-to flavor. And this cookies and cream is hitting right now. So, new flavor alert. As y'all can see, the texture and consistency of these is like so smooth and rich that it's still like in my mouth. I'm still trying to get it out because it's so just caramelly <laughs> when i love something i love it i will keep telling y'all about it telling y'all about it telling y'all about it until y'all try it for yourselves and see what y'all like i cannot speak for everyone but the flavors that i have tried so far i thoroughly enjoy them i will put my code across the screen for y'all as always use my code y'all get some money off and try these bars because they are good. So, I'm gonna eat this bar while I decide if I'm gonna cook tonight or if I'm gonna pick something up because kinda leaning towards picking something up, but why won't I just make the food that I have in the fridge? Why is that so hard to do? I don't understand. I can do this with my eyes closed. It's too easy. It's too, it's too easy. I can do this with my eyes closed. It's too easy. It's too, it's too easy. It's too easy. I've been there, done it, seen it. Boy, all that like Kenny. Still got crack, they feeling. Flow still hot like Phoenix. Shine so bright, I'm gleaming. This off top, I'm tweaking. Fresh out the rat like Nina. And I'm still trying to fight my demons. 
Cause we all gotta act like Tino. That's why I gotta ride with the Nino. Outside, it's a war going on. Maybe put my hands on my head like the Macarino. They want you walking on board like Kimo. Ain't give a F to you like John Cena. Putting blood on the brand new Beamer. Trying to earn eight stripes like Adidas. You get cold when you ride with the heater. It'll turn you to a dog like a Keto. And exposed to a cat like a cheetah. They smoke my partner like Reef. Dime lo porque o no entiendo mi gente must really need Jesus. He said real blood, I never seen the crypt and I believe it. It's too easy. Too, too easy. I can do this with my eyes closed. It's too easy. Too, it's too easy. I can do this with my eyes closed. Y'all just talk, don't live it. And just took that route, that seen it. And I'm so outspoken like reason. Jimmy Neutron, boy, young jeans. And I'm a self made man out of Sweden. And it's still off top, I'm tweaking. But I still gotta fight my demons. I ain't no good, I'm evil. I ain't been clean since Eden. It's a war going on outside. Make you put your hands on your head like the Macarena. That's why I gotta watch my demeanor. You know they locking up blacks and Latinos. It's the same old game, ain't nothing really changed. But the mileage on the meter of the beam. You get cold when you ride with the heater. It'll turn you to a dog like a keto. And exposed to a cat like a cheetah. They smoke my partner like reefer. Dime lo porque o no entiendo mi gente must really need Jesus. He said, real blood, I never seen the crypt and I believe it. It's too easy. Too easy. Too easy. I can do this with my eyes closed. It's too easy. Too. It's too easy. I can do this with my eyes closed. to get some protein because your girl is what trying to get the gains but i forgot to tell y'all so today i hit maxes in the gym today or personal records in the gym for myself today so obviously y'all know a while back i had got my individual my one rep maxes for like squats deadlifts hip thrusts things like that but obviously when you're doing multiple sets of those exercises for multiple, multiple reps, you're not lifting your max. Typically you go maybe 70%, 60%, 50% of your max when you're doing multiple sets and reps of those exercises. So today I hit personal goals for myself. Um, for my squats, I think I did 50 pounds on each side, the same for hip thrust, which I've not ever been able to lift like 50 pounds on each side doing my hip thrust for multiple sets. And I did five sets of 10 reps for all of the exercises that y'all saw today. Um, and yes, y'all, that is an indication that we are getting stronger. Like I told y'all, if y'all don't have one of these, hence a fitness journal, you need to get one because that is how you are going to be tracking progress every week, tracking your weight, 
making sure that you going up and you getting stuck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So hopefully that makes sense. But being that I was able to lift um, that amount of weight for multiple reps, you know, multiple sets, I want to go ahead and get my individual um, like one rep max for those exercises again to see if I've gone up because I'm pretty sure I have definitely have since the last time I got those. So we are progressing over her and we getting them gains over her. Ay, ay. Anyways, so yes, protein. Of course, today was a lower body day. So I'm gonna stock up on some carbs. Um, with this, probably eat like some pasta. Um, that Cajun pasta that I had last time, last week was so good. Um, but yeah, carbs, protein. Need to get some fats too, so I'll probably eat some boiled eggs as well, just to get some good fats in there. But we going up, y'all. And we getting stuck up there. Period. Oh, he don't want to talk to y'all. It is a new day, y'all. When I tell y'all, my legs are so sore from yesterday's workout. Do y'all hear me? So today is definitely gonna be cardio. And you know what? It's not even gonna be heavy cardio. It's mainly gonna be upper body focused. And I want to show y'all some of my go-to ab exercises and core exercises that I've been doing throughout the week because I'm kind of always switching up my core exercises just to make sure I'm really, really targeting, um, you know, various core muscles. So I'm gonna be showing y'all that. I have on this cute little outfit, y'all. Of course, when everyone sees this pattern, they think it's leasy fit or leachy fit. Um, but this is from Fashion Nova. Um, I don't even know if they still have this, but my mom actually gave me this. And y'all, I love the back of it. I just love that little um, cutout that it has back there. Y'all see J scope on the waist on the waist today, just because y'all my. My body is just sore and I feel like this is really giving me some support that I need because this lower half, I feel like it's going to detach from my body. That's how sore my legs are right now. So, you know, y'all know the deal. Pre-workout is what I'm definitely going to need today. I'm thinking about doing a caffeine detox because y'all know I pretty much drink pre-workout with every workout that I do. And I work out pretty much basically six times a week. I get like one rest day in there sometimes two rest days but pretty much it's like six times a week um so i'm drinking caffeine like pretty much every day and i don't know it just doesn't seem good to me you know so this girl i know at the gym who also recommended this pre-workout to me um she's been doing a caffeine detox and she was telling me that she just feels good you know um and that doing it allowed her to lower her dosage of pre-workout and it still give her the same effect that it would if she was taking like a full scoop, you know? So not really any drastic differences, but something just to kind of like reset your body, refresh and um, get you off of that caffeine. Because I know for me personally, I feel like my body is kind of dependent on pre-workout to have like a really intense workout. And I don't know, it just doesn't, that don't seem good to me. So definitely feel like, I'm kind of stalling on it because I do love my pre-workout so much. And um, yeah, I want my pre-workout, but I'm definitely contemplating doing a caffeine detox and not having any, you know, pre-workouts that have caffeine in them, um, BCAs that have caffeine in them, nothing, energy drinks, nothing caffeine during that time. So I'll probably do it for like three weeks, two to three weeks, depending on but of course, I will let y'all know. And when I do, y'all will see the full scoop. So today though, we are about to go ahead and make us a pre-workout. This is also the last week, y'all, of Fittober 21. Y'all know that's been my daily challenge. Um, and I've really been adding those challenges to my workout all week. I actually did a boomerang on my Instagram yesterday. And in that boomerang, I was like, you know what? I'm really seeing a difference in just overall definition. I feel like I am um, really building muscle, which y'all know is my overall goal during this time. Of course, right now it's 
pretty much game season. Um, most people aren't really cutting during this time. You know, it's really about the gains, really about packing on, you know, a few pounds here and there, really trying to get muscle to where, you know, once the warmer months roll back around and you're cutting, you got a little bit more to work with. You know what I'm saying? So I'm kind of honestly doing a little bit of both, which I'll explain to y'all a little later as well. But yeah, y'all know how I do everything over here is trial and error. When it comes to me, you know, making my workout plans and all that stuff, it's all trial and error just to where I'm making sure that, you know, more than anything, I'm being my own um, guinea pig <laughs> and testing out, you know, kind of like my process for working out to make sure that it is effective. So yeah, been doing a little bit of cutting and bulking um, phases during this time because I don't wanna just strictly bulk because I didn't do a drastic cut throughout the summer. So there's no need for me to do a drastic bulk. So yeah, I definitely enjoy the Fittober challenges. This week has honestly been the hardest because if y'all are doing the challenge, y'all know that we have higher reps of each exercise to do or that we've been doing throughout the week and girl they have been testing your girl's strength endurance stamina all of it okay money coming money go i've been at it i've been at it on a low dropping out of where i live i keep seeing the leaders doing this we talking plans and maybe seeing you pull up on you let me school nobody here but me and you Got a little ring to it, turn that thing fluid in the cool. Why you look, I know it's real. I'm on my mind, I've been really getting a feel. You know why I'm here, don't act like you know how I feel. But let me tell you what you mean to me. Slide on me for that mean greet. Vibe with me in the moonshine, sipping moonshine to the new sky. Taste toasted and be race soaked in the raincoat. Hit the waist quota, I'll be flossing, I'll be locked in. What's lost here? All that turned me to a target. They be plotting on me, I'll be cautious. Then I was an adolescent, then I had a lesson, I'm the man now, I got fans now, I'm on cam now, I got plans now, I'm finna branch out, grew up quick, but never let go of this year, I put all of that in my rip, hey. blues and papers, blowing vapors, wood and traders, long hair killer in my villa, bitch, I made it, used to play to play, now I think we made it now, she wanna lay me down, I'ma need you to hold me all the way down, put it down for me, say you down for me, say you Say you hold it all the way down, hold it down for me, hold it down for me. Say you say you hold it all the way down, say you down for me, hold it down for me. Say you say you hold it all the way down, hold it down for me, say you down for me. Wait, okay. I really got like a ten of me, saw a trip. I got the recipe, and you can find me where that pressure be. I've been levitated in the preparation. I've been meditated. I've been hella patient. I'm so tired of waiting. I got right here with my day. From where that crevice be. I've been solid since the lesson me. I hear with the sea, really in the field. I'm really on cam now. I got plants now. I'm finna branch out. Grew up quick, but never let go of this year. I put all of that in my rip. Hey. Blues and papers, blowing vapors, wood and traders. Long hair killer in my villa, bitch. I made hey. Used to play to play. Now I think we made it now. She wanna lay me down. I'ma need you to hold me all the way down. Hold it down for me. You say you down for me. You say you, you say you hold it all the way down. Hold it down for me. Hold it down for me. Say you, you say you hold it all the way down. You say you down for me. Hold it down for me. You say you, you say you hold it all the way down. Hold it down for me. You say you down for me. Transforming now these cars and planes, I'm always boarding. Just out touring down in Charlotte like I play for Hornets. When I'm performing, never boring, now you can't afford it. Champagne Perrier, finish friends on my face. Looking like I'm from the D, D's no Cartier. Pockets deep, 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 bro. I can make it in my seat, bro. Do you, I'm doing me, bro. Making noise, use a beat, bro. Neighborhood be the name, neighborhood no crib. 
Overseas then, we gon' go, go, go Whoa, whoa, I press the button 